Hello everyone, welcome to the daily analysis video. So tomorrow market is going to again open and let's discuss uh, with the help of the data points what we are going to expect next. Uh, so uh, on Thursdays, um, uh, like I did not get time to post the video. So I uh, posted my analysis on Twitter and also on YouTube community. So I said that my final verdict is sell on rise. And uh, so uh, as you saw, like in Nifty, so uh, every time in the morning it tried to rise. So there was selling happening but uh, this uh, even here also uh, a market tried to go down but somehow it was managed and went up because even if you see here that is there was hidden bearish divergence happened here then again here as well so uh, but market and even in our money flow indicator also there was a clear cut divergence uh, at the end events and that gap hasn't yet bit uh, has hasn't yet been uh, filled up so uh, talking about our uh, other data points, so uh, let's go to the EOD data. So EOD data is saying that uh, your futures activity, so it's uh, like uh, some uh, long positions have been made and some short positions have been closed, but overall FIs are heavily shorted in the futures. And uh, talking about prop decks, they are like closing both the sides. They are just confused, I think, for now. Now talking about the option chain, so option chain, uh, call buying has been somewhat little bit done by the FIIs uh, and also put writing has been done and uh, so then the question arises uh, are we going to see a bullish move so I'm going to answer that uh, so I think the little bit of extra call buying is basically to hedge their future short positions that they have recently made now talking about prop decks prop decks they have also done put writing and they have closed huge amount of call writing and did some call buying so Overall, in the February month, like uh, uh, prop decks, they are call buyers and uh, put writers. Okay, so they are like as you can see, call buyers, and here they are put writers. So uh, even for the uh, FIs also, for now they are put writers, and uh, they are uh, uh, no. So for the FIs, they put writers as well as they are call writers. Okay, so now let's go to the option chain and explore a li little bit more to understand where these put writings have been done. So coming to fin uh, Nifty's uh, option chain, if you look at here, the majorly uh, the call writing has been done at 22,000 here. Okay, so uh, majorly the chunk is here that is uh, almost uh, like uh, more than seven, uh, just a little bit of, uh, so let's say there are almost 70 lakhs contracts are there here. And th on the put side, if you look at here, that is 21,500 is having overall of, uh, I mean 50, uh, almost 50 lakhs contracts okay so now try to understand the difference that is uh, market is at 21800 okay and you see the call writers are at 22000 so which is just almost two th uh, 200 points away uh, and having uh, like 70 lakhs contracts and on the other hand you see that almost 300 points away the put writers are there uh, but that, that also like the cumulative OI is almost 50 lakhs okay so now try to understand that on which side like market can go and uh, where the big guys are like um, uh, what the big guys are thinking. Now you would say that yes put writing has been done. Now I'll show you something uh, uh, that is like uh, you will you'll get to know something that is now here as I al always say that uh, these big guys they have which uh, like these FIs they have like let's say that they have 500 crores or thousand crores whatever so they are going to uh, take uh, like huge positions and uh, they uh, they uh, they take safe safer bets okay so safer bets means like they are expecting that by this week 21,000 won't come so now they are going and shorting at 21,000 at let's say like 8 rupees or 7 rupees okay and which is a good premium overall if you like if uh, every week if you just eat like 7 rupees or uh, 8 rupees so you, you get a nice return over the year so we, we are going to calculate that in one of the videos uh, and I'm going to show you that even eating small premiums every week can give you a huge return now uh, talking about here they are there like for, as you can see 50 lakhs contracts are here almost sorry 45 lakhs contracts are here overall and again here that is 20,800 again here that is 20,500 okay so uh, even like 20,500 which I think is the they have hedged their positions by buying there but majorly like if you see here that is 7.6 lakhs contracts have been added here then 20,809.2 uh, lakhs contracts have been added here 
and also some uh, are here that is like uh, 3.8 uh, sorry 8.3 lakhs contracts are here 21,200 which is like which was the last trading price was almost uh, 16 rupees okay so that is where the put writing has been done and uh, now talking about our bank nifty so uh, even in bank nifty as well uh, you can very well see that uh, the 45,000 is the uh, put um, major OI put concentration and uh, then 46,000 we have the call OI concentration but you would say that the call why they are closing so because uh, market went straight away uh, up uh, on Friday so that's why some uh, writers have closed but you see that uh, like even still it's for uh, it's almost 40 lakhs contracts but here that is 45,000 it's still having like which is a lot far away but on the put side you'll see the cumulative OI is almost 26 lakhs so uh, then you should ask the question why then okay talking about fin nifty as well so if even if you look at the pcr ratio also it's not uh, indicating huge bullishness or something so uh, even for fin nifty it's uh, the pcr ratio is 0 0.73 now talking about fin nifty again as you can see in the money call writers are waiting at 20200 uh, and uh, also talking about our uh, like this uh, it, uh, I mean this is having one of the highest open interest on the call side and uh, on the put side like it's not very like uh, as you can see again on the put side heavy concentration of put writers are not there in one of the strike price in fin nifty so uh, that uh, like arises a question so now the thing is that uh, again on Fridays, usually the what happens is that the data points uh, like uh, say something and something else happens. Uh, I have shown you that even go the last Friday and again the last Friday. So what happens is that these Fridays are mainly like the fresh position starts building up and so on. So the main analysis like don't follow because even if you go on last Friday and see there were many bearish divergences but it did not come. Okay. So uh, I think last to last or the last one. So ju uh, uh, just go and check. Now what happens is that fresh positions start building up and that's why the Friday is uh, market doesn't actually follow. And again, there is another point uh, thing on Fridays as well. Like uh, suppose suddenly you will see that even on Friday uh, the market fell sharply. Okay, because uh, many the, many many traders doesn't trade on Friday and so uh, you uh, also sometimes Fridays are chosen for huge moves as well. So anyways, uh, you can't do anything, but uh, I we have taken some positional positions. So let's see how that goes. And uh, yeah, so that's why I'm not showing the Telegram channel. Uh, so yeah, the, that and uh, talking about on the charts again. So let's uh, talk about the levels first. So uh, 21,733 is uh, one of the new levels that are developing. Uh, Nifty is concentrating around that level. So below that we are going to see 21,588. So this should have come to 21,588, but somehow, uh, as you know, like some, uh, uh, someone took it up and, uh, okay. So anyways, uh, uh, so again, 21,588 is also not a major level. If it comes like, as you have seen, uh, that is uh, the major concentration of put writers are 21,500. Why? Because uh, you have this uh, band which is a good support at 21,525 to 21,497. Okay. Talking about bank nifty again, bank nifty can get resistance at 45,775. And if it comes below here, that is 40,595. And even if that breaks, 44,776. And uh, also, you know, our lines of controls, the yellow dotted lines. Fin Nifty again concentrating at 20,000 after breaking 20,393 it came straight away to 20,101 hour level and it's concentrating there again Fin Nifty also somewhat it should have gone down a little more as you can see to the next level which is uh, or the price band which is at around 19,906 okay so that's um, the overall discussion so yeah so again uh, market is going to open tomorrow so we'll see what happens and how where it opens for now, uh, ex uh, our gift nifty is indicating a little bit of gap up, but uh, again, uh, even after the gap up also, if the big guys are having a loss, so selling can start. So uh, let's see. And uh, again, uh, still, I, I would say that my final verdict is sell on rise and uh, I am going to stick to it. So that's uh, it for this video. So thanks for uh, uh, watching and keep watching and keep learning at trade safely. See you in the next one.